This is Ward. Who am I talking to? Name's V. Looking into the death of one Lucius Ryan. Wonder why? You're not a cop. I'm conducting a private investigation into this matter. Good luck with that. And do me a favor, lose this number. I like P.I.'s about as much as I like the Scopic Caliente. I'm no private eye. So what are you? Meet me. You'll find out. All right. I'm headed to Chubby Buffaloes. Be their staff. Hey, Judy, what's up? Hey. Can you come over, Stat? Something happen? Yeah. Just come. Express her undying gratitude to you for saving her ass. Stop talking. I was, I was only gone an hour. You, you checked your pulse. She's gone. Got to do something with her. Don't want any trouble. I'm calling the badges. Can you carry her to the bed? As if that'll change anything. Yeah, I, I need to report an accidental death. North side, Jackson Street. No. No. Imminent danger. <laughs> Suicide. Tomorrow? No! Today! What part of dead don't you understand? No, she was not pronounced dead by trauma team. If she'd have had coverage, we wouldn't be talking. And fuck you! If you don't want to move your asses, why don't I come down to the precinct and trash it into bits? Now will you come and arrest me, you pussies? Fine, I don't give a fuck what you write me up for. <sighs> They'll be here soon. <sighs> told me to keep her on ice until tomorrow. Can you believe the balls? All things considered, you let them off pretty light. Had it been me, they'd have gotten an earful like nobody's biz. Put something on her. I'd rather she look like a person than a body. 
Could you wait outside? Close the door, V. Please. <sighs> Bummer, Sig. Didn't know you smoked. <sighs> Quit. It's been years. But... Right now, I need something besides air in my lungs. Please, V, just one. Fine, here. That was her smoke case. Wanna hold on to it? No. You seem to like it. Keep it. I'm kind of glad it's you that has it, actually. Fuck, Evie. I let her down. I thought if I gave her some t space or time, she'd get back on her feet. Stay strong, Judy. Don't let this tear you down. Know what? Let's just not say anything for a minute, okay? Her condition... couldn't think about anything else. Tech-wise, she was clean. Dull Shard was operational, uncorrupted. So... Psychological trauma. Had to be that. Did some more digging in her virtues, found Woodman. He kept her, and had his way with her, the things he did. And once he got bored, he pawned her off. What did Woodman do to her? Did you see it? Yeah. And I really wish I could unsee it. No idea that guy was such a monster. Saw him as your average Trixie sleazebag. It puts on a convincing facade. I knew him, but I never thought him that sick in the brain. Gotta be something I can do about it. Like what? Don't know yet. Think I'll call Suze. Thanks, V. Sorry, but uh, I'd rather be alone now. I promise to keep in touch. Sure you don't need anything? No, but sweet of you to ask. Anything comes up, holler on the hollow.
Someone here to see you, looks like. Hold on. Wonder what about. Wanted to talk. You got a minute? You must be V. My partner, Detective Han. Mind if we step off to the side? Han and me, we're like one mind. Got no secrets. You really intend to work with a merc? Don't know what I intend just yet. For now, I'm gonna see if I hear anything new about Ryan's death. You back on that? Boss already told you to drop it. I can say it again. You know he hates to say things twice. And if you couldn't give a rat's fat ass about any of that, heed my advice. As your friend, just let the case go. See me do anything? Just sitting here, sipping coffee, listening to gossip. Fine. Do what you want. I'm not about to be part of this. Gotta go get my little girl anyway. And you two at least find a quieter corner. Wouldn't want to be overheard. Okay. Talk. See, Detective Han's not a fan of edge runners. Don't take it personally. Detective Han's not a fan of anybody. Except his daughter. You wanted to talk? For the attack, you wanted to talk to Ryan's hustle. Get some info to him. What was it? Let me ask you a question first. Why do you got your nose in this? Who hired you? Liz Perales hired me. And her husband, Jefferson. The presumed future mayor. <laughs> Guess I could have seen that coming. You know what? Han was right. Acoustics are a little too good in here. Got my car outside. Okay, sure. Some of the boys from the precinct saw Horvath around Arroyo, shooting up dumpsters, hollering how he's got to meet with the mayor. Brought him in. Brought who in? Peter Horvath. Cyber psycho who attacked the mayor later. They took him downtown, but then he got lost before they could get his statement. Said he got lost. How's that happen? What's it mean? It means someone didn't want him counting roaches in a cell that day. And before you ask me, no. I got no idea who. My turn. Why is Perales looking at this now? Why does he want it done unofficial on the hush-hush? Perales could just be scared. Doesn't want the job of a guy who just got carried out feet first? <laughs> who would? Red Queen's race. Heard anything about it? Know what it is? Maybe I have. Maybe I do. It got anything to do with Ryan? Guy was headed there the day he died. <sighs> Fine. We're gonna see my CI. All I've heard is some fancy-ass club. No idea where to even look for it. CI might know. Then we'll go talk to the woman Horvath worked for. Or actually, we could see her first. Up to you. Let's go see his boss first. Guy who can afford all the chrome he was decked out in should have the scratch for psycho-muting meds, too. We better check it out. Okay. Ninety percent of any detective's job is talking. And the other ten percent? What's it consist of? Writing reports. So, who are we supposed to talk to? Cyber Psycho's boss, you said? 
Christine Markov, 42. File has her as Horvath's sole employer. Sole contact, too, actually. Come on, V. V, the Basilisk. It's ready. Would you like to drive it? Sure. Be there soon. Fuck me. It is awesome. So I hear. idea who we're looking for. Gonna have to ask around. I'll start from the left and take the right. You Christine Markov? No, but I know Christine who she Markov. is. Stand with the tech over on the other side. Find something? Not get out. Christine Markov? Me? No. She's over there. Stalled with the tank. Thanks. <coughs> okay, you got it. You Christine Markov? We have some questions. You badges? Nope, not cops. Just looking for some intel. Everyone's always looking for something. At least I know where I stand with the cops. Other people. I open your mouth one day and Corpo Muscle or Gangoon show up on your doorstep the next. Peter Horvath. Worked for you, right? Yeah, he did. Then he stopped working, started making fucking speeches all the time. These speeches. What did he have to say? Ryan, if Corpse got him by the balls and cock, but he still managed to fuck me. His motto. Why do you have it in for the mayor? Ha! <laughs> Looking for reason in that whack job? Probably thought Ryan was talking to him through the TV, promising all sorts of shit, then ceasing to give a fuck. Look, I told you what I think. In Horvath's world, everybody was out to get him. Lucius Ryan was out to fuck him, then get him. Had no other connection those two. Think hard. Easy money? That's what Horvath was after. Didn't do time for nothing. <sighs> Worked for normals, not so normals. Maybe he and Ryan had some mutual friends. Would that be all, detectives? You're spooking my Cleon's help. So Horvath had a personal beef with Ryan. We might have guessed as much. Might seem like we didn't get a lot out of that. But sometimes intel makes sense once you've got some context. Say, for instance, somebody says they got a headache. Minor detail. Means nothing, right? Usually, sure. Mind if then I just the guy bruise? Wants straight into oncoming traffic. Neighbor remembers... Just... Someone had worked on the air conditioner in the guy's unit. The guy whose head always hurt. Accident? Coincidence? Or maybe air dispersed poison? A deliberate hit. You actually caught a case like that? No. Made it up. Still proves my point. Let me handle this, V. Step aside, Lug. Your boyfriend got sent up for years. Doubt you want 
Talk. Walk in the streets with you? <laughs> Downright unsafe. Got a beef with all gangs or just the tigers? I'm a cop. What do you think? Uh, gotta report this. I'll talk to my CI about your club, Red Queen's Race. Assuming you're still on board. You kidding? First, I gotta clean up the mess you made. We'll meet there. Turn it into a All ready to go? Hey, V. No, not yet. Carol still needs to check if Militech left any ice in the system. Corpos haven't shown up in person to report the loss? No, I think we managed to keep them off our scent. We left the trucks with the big Corpo logos down by the wrapping camp. Which was almost as much fun as leaving a bag of flaming dog shit on their doorstep. Fuck, made it look like it just came back from a Corpo War tour. Nice touch. Everything's fine. Clean as a whistle. Always wanted to take one of these suckers for a spin. Which is exactly how all those naive gonks landed at the front. Didn't even need to be recruited. They just showed you the tech. Come on, hop in. Everything is set. Let's fire her up. Hold on to your head. Damn it. Anybody get this thing up and running earlier? Maybe you Everything gotta... is dandy. Give me a moment. Not the latest model, but Mitch and Bob did what they could. What do you think? Not exactly how I imagined a Corpo Panzer. I mean, at least since I stopped watching all those anime BDs. You steer directly from your seat. All you have to do is jack in. What, no knobs, buttons, blinky doodads? No, none. The impulse runs directly to your cerebral cortex. In a sense, the basilisk becomes an extension of your body. It's like a mystical oneness. Well, if it's so mystical and shit, why the co-pilot? Extra support? I'll tell you once we're a bit further from camp. We'll practice. Okay, if you want full functionality in an engagement, you need a second person to handle sensory overload. One pilot steers, the other handles the gun. It's oddly pleasant. 
You'll see. Okay, this will do fine. A dry run first. I'll disconnect for now. Doesn't need two pilots? You won't be steering and firing. Are you ready? Pan Am? Is this, uh, as designed? Neural synchronization doesn't happen at the snap of one's fingers. It'll be over soon. There. See? Okay. Starting to understand what you meant. Warm up. Don't worry. I'm not gonna watch. Just put it through a few turns. Soft, right? Same as a boat. Mm -hmm. She'll fly right over any bumps. All types of... All right. I can see you've grown bored. Now take her along the line of turbines. When I say so, swerve right or left before the last of them. All right. What the fuck are you doing? Either go back now, or I take the wheel. Oh my god. Left. Very good. Keep her going. Right. Yes. That's the way to do it. What's on the menu? Don't get excited. The Basilisk is a cargo ship by design. But it should still be a good time. All right, blast those threats. Okay, practice is over. Good. Now I'm going to connect. It could feel strange. Meaning. Basilisk pilots have to be fully synchronized. That means our nervous systems will be linked. Okay. It's as if you booked a room with two beds, but got a double bed with a blanket wide enough for half. Okay, let's try this. Guess I'll get to know you better than I'd planned. All right. Let me just say, it can be difficult at first. You'll experience feedback, sensory echoes as our systems overlap. Probably comes naturally in combat. Mm-hmm. Right. Starting now.
all of us. Each on his or her own must think first and foremost of what's good for the family. Come on, Saul. If I have to leave the clan, please just say so. Spare me another speech of yours at the very least. I'm afraid you'll have to sit through a few more. Because from this day forward, you will lead this family by my side. I will what? I wish to do this properly, but fine. Have it your way. I was wrong. You were right. That's the truth. May it never happen again. But I, I, I made a mess of so many things. You said... I know. But I changed my mind. You risked everything for this family. Not even knowing whether you'd be welcome the next day. Okay. Okay. Well, I... Many things will have to change. Yes. And to start with, we need to leave this place. Quickly. We can't wait for Militech to find us. Of course. I will prepare our route. Congratulations. Terrible choice. I voted nay. Thank you. Thanks. I need to cool down, I think. Will you come with me? An interesting day. I feel as if I've barely evaded a rapidly approaching train. It's pretty close. I don't know if I could have done it without you. <laughs> Come on. No, I'm serious. We all owe you. So you can count on the Alda Caldas. Always. Good to know. Nobody's behind the bar. That I like. Beer? Lemonade? Beer me. To happy endings. Gonna miss our little escapades. Me too. On the other hand, though, who said this one was our last? V, look around. Look at them. They could be your family. Panem, what do you. Stay in camp. Join us. It's really not that simple. You either want to or not. What's so complicated? That's the problem. What I want right now doesn't mean a thing. All right, V. I shouldn't drop bombs like that on you right now. I just thought, eh, forget about it. Maybe once you move camp, we'll. Panem, I... V, relax. Everything is okay. How do you feel? What happened? I, I remember I... We were talking, then suddenly... You passed out. Completely. We took you with us. Where? Somewhere new. We moved camp. Don't worry, we are safe here. For now. Oh, V. V, you have to tell me what is happening. The blood. You were out for hours. What's wrong? Pan Am, I... It's getting worse. Every single day. Okay. B, relax. Take it bit by bit. What is happening, exactly? 
Okay, so... Uh, you ever hear of the relic? The Arasaka tech? The something with personalities? I saw the ads. Sounds like some rich people scam, to be honest. It's not bullshit. I've got a biochip in my head with one of those constructs. And the chip's damaged. So take it out! Definitely not that simple. Relic's also keeping me alive, but... So this is cyberpsychosis? Because if it is, I know no, people who... No, no. The chip's data is infecting my neural connections. Got nothing to do with cyberpsychosis. I remove the relic. I die. If I don't deal with the construct, I die. Fuck. Just trying to live with it. Survive, actually. It's certainly not doing wonders for your health. I gotta go. Feeling better. Really. Wait. I will go with you. I thought I heard that voice. Hey, Mitch. Finally. We were worried. Took good care of your ride. She's over there. But you're not leaving us already, are you? Is everything okay? Thanks. I'll stick around for a bit. Make yourself at home. Remember, our offer still stands. If you need help, the the Caldos are here for you. Then that, at least, we can agree on. If you need anything, you know where to find us. Want me to walk with you? I know this area, back from the old roots. You're really safe here, though? For now, yes. Militech does not venture this far. And our vantage points really are much better. Hey! Welcome back to the land of the living! About time Sleeping Beauty decided to join us. Hey there. You know, everything here, it is temporary. All of it. We will soon have to decide what comes next. V, back to what we were saying. I will not even pretend to understand. I don't think it has even sunk in yet. But, I am serious. How can I help? Honestly. Not a clue. But there has to be something. Someone who can... Remember Hellman? He's the one who created the personality construct. That's why you wanted to get him. But it was a dead end. Now I have to figure out where to go next. You'll find a way. And once you do, let me know. I will help. This whole family will help. Saul was not joking. You understand? Thanks, Anna. How am I supposed to know where he got that knife? Ask him yourself Obi? when he gets back.
You are V. We have been waiting. Couldn't meet somewhere else? Not big on funerals. Do not be frightened, Etrange. This funeral is not for you. You my contact? Someone finally gonna tell me about this job? I'm just a man in the middle. You will learn more. Soon. You screening me? See if I came alone? What kind of chrome I got? Is some kind of test? Most people we work with, we knew as babies. We know they're angels. You, we do not know. Wanna talk with Brigitte? She here somewhere? No. Shopping center by the intersection. Go to the butcher shop there. Ask for Placid. He will tell you the details. Michel avec moi. Bon Dieu avec moi. Sorti tant qu'on l'a toujours fait. Il pas fait aucun sens pour ces licognards. Juste donne. Moi, pas qu'on est. Il te semble très déterminé. Oh, il pas changé l'idée. Tant qu'on tout le temps. Looking for Placide. Placide. Gardez ici, là. Do, do, ti, 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 C'est vous même. Continuez. Placide, gardez-la. You placide? Mm -hmm. Told me at the chapel you're the one to talk to. Mr. Hans sent me. Said you got merc work needs doing. No here. Come with. This way. Welcome to Pacifica. You know Pacifica well. No. You guys aren't exactly great at rolling out the welcome mat for outsiders. Was to be its own city where suits were burned the eddies. A close circle. The cops feed the sheep, they spit the cash back out. All the toys here are grown from copper cash. Our interest is now in the GIM, the Grand Imperial Mall. Pacifica's biggest, ugliest temple to build, but never finished. Until last week, it was deserted, empty. But now? The animals crawled in, made a nest. Okay, my pal Vinnie Peter.
Ajoudia. Vita et Emily, mais pas prier. You deal with animal before? Yeah, a few times. You want the animals out of the gym? Extinct? That why you hired me? You learn everything soon. I mean, it makes no sense, them being here. Middle of Pacifica, no backup, cut off. It's your turf. Hell, even badges don't patrol around here. Uh-huh. They're trying to provoke you? Make you do something stupid? They do not leave Jiaim. How many are we talking about in there? Daddy, maybe more. Vinina, we talk here. You sit. When do I see Brigitte? You do job. That is first. What the hell? You could fucking tell me what you plan to do first. You take job. You do what I say. So you chuck in. Now. Well, what? You got a line of volunteers waiting? V? Home stretch. Almost there. Do not fuck this up. Damn it. Here goes nothing. Well, at least he's not likely to talk your ears bloody. Got a feeling we're not gonna become best friends. No chemistry. I will survive. Evelyn Parker. Ring a bell? Not one of us. She did work for you once. Why not send your own goons to the gym? It's not our way. How's that been working out for you? What good? Good more than bad. Your comb, shaman. It is Victor. That at all relevant? Or just a cheap scare tactic? I need you to be able. I need no. This cheap. It have no signature. What is it? Unimportant. Busted, anyway. Hmm. How? Got a bullet to the brain. Hasn't worked since, that's how. Hmm. Once inside, what do I do? The camionet. Twenty, thirty-five, zero seven. Three seconds before, poof. We try to learn where the camionet come from. Tech looks pretty advanced. Doesn't scream meathead to me. They watch it very close. <clears throat> it is important, whatever it Placid. is. Batman Kelly have this and i Femme Portla. Time for a break. I think you might be needed. They will manage fine. You focus. Animals aren't the play here, are they? They're hired muscle. Someone else needed them. Someone with a van full of net runner tech. And that's where I come in? To sniff out who? Mm -hmm. Start with the communet. Hide from all eyes. Only see the situation. You have now seen Quetrizo Agwe, our subnet. Why? What for? You are, you are my vessel now. now. To I see what, what you see, hear what, what you hear. I will, I will guide you, you to G.I.M. Another voice in your head, just what the Ripper Doc ordered. So, aim to keep an eye on me. Shows trust. All right. Anything else I should know? Find our people near Mall. They will show you how to get inside the beast. My pay. How much we talking, and how am I gonna collect? And say you not in this for cash. You in this for problem. Do GIM for us. Brigitte can solve it. Uh-huh. Except then I found out you need me to be a bullet trap on enemy turf. That means my fee's just gone up. Mm, we will see. No promise. 
Got it. So I do this, and you put me in front of Brigitte, right? Yes. Suti at the end of the hall. Go down. My people will let you pass. We are done. None too fond of strangers here, are you? People like you. Stick out. Meaning, best watch it. Mm-hmm. Wise. So, voodoo boys. Why? Don't seem to believe in voodoo. Don't know. Ask those who call us this. Mean to say you call yourselves something else? And you ain't gonna tell me, are ya? Right. V? Know the way in? Was told you would. Yeah. Garage in the back. But shh. Quietly, yeah? Anything interesting happen over there? Since we are here, all quiet. No one in, no one out? Well, they went out for supplies once.
Access to their data. Clear? You must first proceed. Whoa, hey, easy. What did you do? Well, now we can talk in private. Just severed the connection to the rest of Pacifica. Gives us a little time. All right. Then let's hear it. Had a specter on you, didn't you? Saw and heard all you did. You followed his orders. No idea what the voodoo boys are paying you, but our pockets are deeper. Not interested. Not a money job for me. Just need an end with Maman Brigitte, Voodoo Sheffin. Brigitte and her lapdog T Neptune have been frozen several days now, ever since we shrouded their subnet with ice. And you? Well, you were sent here to free them. Do you know why they didn't tell you everything? Cause you're a Ranyan. That's what they call outsiders brought in for special jobs, floor rags. When you're no longer needed, they chuck you. A fate for all Ranyans. You're bluffing. Got your back against the wall, can't budge, no room to dodge the bullet. I see no reason why both of us shouldn't walk out of here alive. Oh, want what's best for me? Altruism now part of the Netwatch mission? You don't gotta like us to see we're better partners than the Voodoo Boys. Sure, you might free Brigitte. Can't have much of a combo with her if you're dead. Got anything to back that claim? But the Voodoo's wanna set me up. Wanna? They did it already. Soon as you handed over your weapon, slipped in the Spectre and a virus. <laughs> Talking as if he was there. He's working you. So obvious it hurts. Ask for proof. Besides, I'd know. <laughs> that so? Then please take a look. Run a system diagnostic. Fine. And? Nothing out of place. No trace of... Do it again. Then cross-check the result against the first. Identical, right? Mm-hmm. Because it's not a real scam, it's a copy. Why not attack him head on? Guessing you've identified the voodoo top brass. So what if we have? 
See me as a sly assassin, offing them one by one? Please, don't act like the corps who finance Netwatch don't farm out wet work, let alone the armies they have at their beck and call. Armies make too much noise, and the voodoos are skittish as field mice. What's your beef with the voodoos? Any idea how many attacks from behind the black wall we neutralized last year? Want me to guess? So you don't know. No one in Night City knows, outside of us. And no one wants to know. People imagine it as a great border wall, a one-time solution to protect humanity forever. Whereas, it's more like a torn open trash bag taped over a busted window. And the voodoo boys will not stop poking holes in the fucking thing. All right. What are you offering? A compromise. I'll fish the voodoo virus out of your system. And I'll release both Brigitte and T. Neptune. They'll wake up like nothing ever happened. Not to worry. And all you gotta do is let us walk. With our data. Th okay, do it. I knew we'd have a meeting of the minds. Can't believe you're falling for this shit. Almost forgot. Mercenary's leaving. She joined the team, so be nice. Don't want any problems. Good luck. Got a feeling we'll be seeing each other. Brigitte and the other guy, are they back? Who told you? Yes, Mama B is awake. Perfect, because I gotta talk to her. And what up, Netwatch? Taken care of. Look for my people at front. We are to take you to Placid. Let's go. GIM. You were to hack the agent, not cut deal with him. You tell me, Ranya. You say what happened. You say or I open you see with my own eye what worm crawling the down. Listen, I didn't turn coat. Didn't pick a side. We made a deal is all. Shh. Did what you wanted. Said instead of getting my circus acid fried, I'm still breathing. That's so damn wrong! This is a stupid. Think you're more clever than that pig? He bend you over, poke you, and you come back smiling. I say, we must head under. I do not know what Netwatch plans, but they are not done. You are worried about agents? Then shoot her in the head. I do not know what they put in her, what corruption is in her system. You don't know what is in there to begin with, how much it is worth. I know. I stand here. Only a normal filthy ranyan. Ali, many moon yon kaboa. Come with me. You know about the biochip, don't you? If it is functional, we offer you good price for it. Biochip's busted. That's why I'm here. Haven't found a single soul capable of getting this thing out of me without scrambling my brain. 
You commissioned the heist, so I figured you must know something. You've gotta. How do you know all this? How did you find us? Listen, can you help me or not? Yes, of course, but not here. We will go to the crib, where you must give us access to the jeep. Once we have the data we need, we will do our best to help you. Then, after you. You guys sure seem to love this place. But, honestly, you don't give off a strong religious vibe. We left our gods on Haiti, yet we are strong here without them. So how come Placide didn't know about the biochip? He didn't recognize it in the scans. Few of our people know about Compeki Tower. But Placide, he is. Your bet de bas. Where are we going? Soon you will see. Watcher did not notice the biochip in you. Strange. Did you let him scan you? Huh? No. Why? It would complicate our work. This an old subway tunnel? No. Part of the transcontinental maglev system. When all states were connected. Like the net, it too crumbled after the war. View a courant. Bon. We take you into the cyberspace. No better place for you to interact with the construct. Okay, hang on. Want to know what you need Silverhand for first? We wish to contact Alt Cunningham. We know she and Silverhand were close. Uh -huh. The relic which Arasaka held close. It is our only lead. Alt Cunningham. Heard of her. Oh. Where? From whom? From Johnny. Though, granted, not much. Johnny? All right, V. Guess you better tell her. Tell her what? About us. Construct's active. Let's me and Johnny shoot the shit every now and then. Mm-hmm. We will look at this, too. What, you think I'm hallucinating? Found myself an imaginary friend? Little is known of how an engram might exist within a human's neural network. I'll tell you one thing. It doesn't shake out well for the human. What's your plan to contact Alt? We try to cut out a unique piece of Silverhand's engram from the biochip. Alt will know it. If something of the human is left after years beyond the Black Wall, she will answer. Well, what? Said nothing about breaking through the Black Wall. Well, now you know. Direction yeah. connected. Connection stop. <sighs> Let's do this. <sighs> Plonger. 
Where are we? This is our BBS, Data Fortress. Bridge to the deep net. So, what now? We can begin. All is ready. We enhance your link to Silverhand's neural network for a short time, to grab the fragment. We must find the data on Alt. Alt alone. This should only take... Brigitte? with a vision. So unless you got a better one, like I said, go fuck yourself. Fuck. Is it the concert or Carrie? Hmm? We in a hurry? Look at you, all hot and bothered. Goodness gracious me. Mm -hmm. A damn shame that's that. What, smoking after sex not zen enough for you? We gotta rewrite the art of war, too? We're done, Johnny. With it all. I just... couldn't ghost without saying... something. So go on, say it. You can be such a bastard sometimes, Johnny. Things were swimming. What? Change your mind? Eats at my gut. Cause you knew what you were signing up for. Look, if you were just another charismatic, narcissistic douche canoe running around after his dream with his head up his ass, I couldn't care less. But? It's all a lie. That concert, samurai, all of it. A ginormous fiction. 
You're not a rocker boy, Johnny. Face it. Ought to join the wired wackos on the corners, frothing at the mouth as they scream death to Arasaka. Huh. I get it. Like to fix your men, huh? Not the first to try, believe me. Honestly, I've got better things to do. Just hoped I'd help you realize you're deluding yourself. And the doing anything about it, that's on you. You're confused. We came here to fuck each other's brains out, not analyze mine. I think we're done for the day, so you can fuck off. See, I thought... ...that this meant something, that we're close? So close you could give me shit about everything I do? Got quite the imagination, then. Where are you going? Got somewhere to be. Silverhand! Hey! Good Alt. noise, Joe. Shoot round when a cop are done! Save it. I don't know for who. Can't kill because there's words! Blaze away! So Down how long you think you're gonna be mad? Let's get out of here. Join us for a drop, Silver Rocker. Another time, Chumbas. What if there won't be another time? Huh? Johnny boy. Let go of me! Johnny! No! Fuck off! Let me alone! Johnny! Let go of me! Come on, rise and shine. Been a while, Johnny boy. How long did you say? Two weeks since I last cobbled you up? Where's Alt? Where's who? Woman who was with me. He brought you and you alone. Fuck, they grabbed her. Nobody saw it? Ask your savior. Said his name was Thompson. That you back there and what? We gotta talk. All right. It's spit and glue, but she's holding tight. Get some rest. Even a few hours, that the stitches set at least. Uh huh. Johnny. Yeah, fuck it. You won't listen anyway. So talk. They wanted her. You. He was just home. And you, just stood there, dick in hand, gawking and dreaming of tomorrow. Would have shredded us both if I jumped in. You see the guy's reflexes? Course not, he was that fast. Tech like that, you don't find in a dumpster. 
Got lucky. Lead panned out. Got some preem footage. Too bad my lead got tossed in the back of a van and sped off. You, uh, aim to do something about it? She was your output, wasn't she? Alt's kidnapping, it's collateral shit. They swiped her to get at me. You even know what she does for a living? Girl's one of the best runners around. Arasaka wants her. Abduction was a standard intercorp extraction. Nothing more. Okay, so what are they after? Soul Killer. An AI. Sound familiar at all? Of course. Urban legend with the shittiest name ever. It's no legend. Soul Killer's real. And your Chumbas at Arasaka just hired the runner who wrote it. Take that in. Saka with Soul Killer to do with as it pleases. Grim, my man. You even imagine that, Rocker? Our sock will be unstoppable. What a steaming load of shit. Let's go. Okay. What's your take then? I'm all ears. Oldest, tritest tale in the world. Our Saka was out to provoke me, and it worked. So what'll it be? Coming with? Where to? Our Saka Tower. To grab Alt right back. Just you and me? You out of your fucking mind? Uh-huh. Come along. Let you watch from the sidelines. Seem to like doing that. I'll be in the car. Can't wait too long, though. You'll wait as long as you need to. Where the hell's Rogue? Sit. Stay. Silverhand! Got an IOU here with your autograph on it. You seen Rogue? She's upstairs. But I heard you two weren't, uh... Well, you heard wrong. Fucking fuck. Johnny, give me a hand here. Heard you weren't talking to me. Dunno. Seem to be talking to you. How about now? Now you can go fuck yourself. Johnny? How's things, Angles? Got a private meet going on in there. Rogue back there, too? Yeah, just... Yeah, yeah, private meet, so you said. Promise to be super unobtrusive. God, I hate this fucking town. Hate these slimy fucking fixers. Hey, this f Johnny. Don't know you. That's no problem. Just as long as everyone else knows Johnny Silverhand.
Lucky I found you. Wasn't sure if you hadn't left town. We're waiting for a client. One who values discretion. You still mad about that thing? What thing, Johnny? That you fucking lied to my face? Put my peeps on the line? Or that you were fucking three other women behind my back before we were through? I got a job. That's it. Urgent. But I got the Euro. How much? Butt out. This isn't your biz. He is now. Rocker just pulled out his wallet. Don't you get it? He's not here about any damn job. He's fucking with me. Last so time this he... this time, you'll be smarter. Take your eddies up front. So... How much, Rocker? It's important. Name your price. Ah. So you're either made of money, or you think we won't live to collect. Either way, Rocker, you're coming with us. Deal. That it is. Urgent indeed. Shit, Johnny. Didn't notice you had a fucking tail? Mr. Silverhand. You're coming with us. Sure. Let me just finish this. Let's get to work. Aren't you, Mr. Popular? longer got trouble in heaps there'll be more at the bottom bet you thou we're parked outside you coming thompson's waiting for me in the car who media you wouldn't know it
Let's get the hell away. We'll be right behind you. So who we gotta pull out of Arasaka? Alt Cunningham, net runner from ITS. Oh. Yeah. The tower. What's it taking her there? This gets better by the minute. How you wanna play this? Either of you gonks got a plan? Yep. Distract him. Make some noise. Nance. She'll know how to draw a crowd. Call on her. Set up right under Arasaka's windows and crank it loud. Blast the pains out. It'll be a gig to remember. We do not as yet have word on the exact number of people hurt in the riots, but our reporters are on the scene at Arasaka Tower, and they all agree. A psychoactive agent has been dispersed at the site, affecting those in the crowd. All right. You recording this whole thing? Uh-huh. Why? Want to say a few words to the folks at home? Do what you gotta do. Just stay out of my way. Thompson. Know him well? No. Why does it matter? Don't like the guy? Don't trust him. And medias are bad luck. What? Bad luck. Say someone finds a tape later. A tape of us breaking into Arasaka Tower. Worry about that if we make it out. Come on, we don't have much time. Uh-huh. No need to explain, sir. Main frame. Gotta yes. find the main yes. frame. Great. Now come. Not bad. I did. Surround I got you. See that spot? They're mine. Ah. Go, go, go! 
Anyone? Let me try. Son of a bitch! Try this. Huh. Now I see why we brought him along. Three, two, one. Watch out! Advise you not to disturb her. What'd you do to Alt? I put her to work on a project of a lifetime. Get out of my way. Alt. Alt, come on, don't do this. Is she? Fuck! Johnny. The hell are you doing? Are you still rolling? This is all we can do now. <laughs> Won't change her. She is not. Johnny! Stop that! You have to kill him? <laughs> we gotta go. Johnny! She's dead. Spit it out before you burst. Wow. Were you going for douchebag of the year? The fuck you going on about? Alt. You always treat her like shit. Don't you fucking mention Alt. Shit, you must have been watching some other flick. I took down Arasaka fucking tower for her. And I'm wondering why. I mean, you told her you two were nothing. You told her you cared about her as far as the end of your cock. Didn't you fucking hear what she said to me? Could have just left, but no, I had to break my balls first. It ever occur to you she might have been right? Taking her side? What is this? Strength and unity? Strength and numbers? Mm, haven't changed a bit. What's that supposed to mean? Looking at it now with 2020 hindsight, nothing occurs to you. No. But this is a bit of a deja vu. You're as bad as she was. Can't understand why you can't just fucking drop it. Is you're planning a reunion? You want to ask Alt for help? And Johnny, you're no solo act. So how the hell you expect Alt to help us? 
I saw her get decommed. She didn't die. She got out. Escaped. Well, looked to me like... She fled into the net. You're pushing bullshit. Heard more than my share of tales about runners who ran off to Never Never Netland. Just never thought you'd be the next to tell me one. Don't need you to believe me, long as you do exactly what I say. When'd you find her? When she made contact a little later. And? What did she say? That she was a captain in the Arasaka subnet. But they couldn't hurt her. And she told me not to come looking for her. So, what did you do? Got my hands on two thermonuclear charges. Then headed back to Arasaka Tower. Buddha boys think they know where she is. Beyond the Black Wall. Where nobody can touch her. And Brigitte's primed to go there. Break through. Just to contact Alt. Talk to her. Too much for our little pro. So, did it work? Yes. We extract a necessary fragment of Silverhand's Angron. We are ready now to make contact with Alt. First, we must dive deeper. returned. She will be the first. I held up my end of our deal. Your turn. Before you pass through that wall, I want Johnny's psyche removed. We will not pass through. You will take the code to the other side. Fuck. Might have guessed. Never had any intention. It does not matter anymore. You would bring all to its end. Don't got much for options, do I? Ali. How do I get to the other side? Brigitte? Yap attacking network lock. What the hell's going on? They breached our BBSs. We have nothing to do with this. Netwatch. <laughs> Netwatch cannot touch me here. It's really you. What happened out there? Couldn't just take him out? Netwatch was well prepared this time. Gotta be Mosley, the fucker. Damn it. I brought Netwatch here. Agent I dealt with must have slipped me a tracker that let him right in. Switch things up on the sly, replacing the Voodoo's virus with his own brand of rot. Probably how they got to you. It matters not. The entire subnet was destroyed. Alt, you pulled us out of there. That mean you and us, we're okay? Everything's chill? I have recognized your engram code, but I do not know why you are here. So you can pay me back for getting you out of our Arasaka Tower. V, this is Alt. Best net runner Night City's ever seen. 
Alt, this is V. You need to save her life. The chip, the relic. It's killing me. Construct on it's worming its way through my neural system. I see this, but why is it my problem? Why the fuck isn't it? You created Soul Killer. You handed Arasaka a fucking super weapon that dismantled me, you, and half the runners in Night City. Your death was of your own making. Jesus, Alt, I dove in after you. Gonna tell me now this ain't your problem? It is not. The Alt Cunningham you strove to save in Arasaka Tower no longer exists. This should be obvious to you, as you were responsible for her death. Okay, I get it. You hate Johnny's guts, but what about me? I cannot help you. Can't or won't? Can't. To attempt to do so, I would need access to more advanced technology. What? But it's your tech. You created Soul Killer. The program I created has little in common with how Arasaka has since repurposed it. Fine, so how about Makoshi? That advanced enough for you? If I could gain access to Mikoshi, it would cease to exist. Good. We can work with that. We'll get you inside Mikoshi and you'll help V. Deal? What can you do for me, exactly? Everyone I've met so far says I'm too far gone. By everyone, you mean Hellman? Saburo's personal ass munch? With the Soul Killer resident inside Mikoshi, I will create a construct of you, then disentangle your neural network from Johnny's. I shall then inject your engram back into your mortal form. Great, so we got a plan. But how will you reach Mikoshi? I've created armies that failed to breach it. They were children of the net. There's your problem. We're banking on the human factor. V's got a big dusty nomad family. And they'll do anything for her. We'll crack a window, slip you into Makoshi. So, we agreed? Yes, we are agreed. Find a path into Makoshi. I shall prepare a program to help you navigate the local net. How will I contact you once I'm ready? This is a BBS address. It will be our secure communication channel. Alt. Before you leave, we gotta talk. Just you and me. No, that will not be possible. <laughs> Couldn't think of a more fitting end. Runner Fox had it coming. As much as it tickles me, too, we got a Delta. Right, still got Mr. Grumps left.
mozie si e bine în față. Si pas jambo li pa ca fe an yelon. Ai din se fe me tete pa toa. Da du fe a ne pot ki kalite an yelon. Ha ha ha. Joke away. But you look pretty spent. Fuck! That was your ticker. Sit and rest. Don't need your flat lining while we got a job to do. <clears throat> blah blah blah. Fuck Arasaka, blah blah. Smash Makoshi. You really are turning into me. <clears throat> Might be right. We're bickering like a shriveled old married couple. It's time we let up. Let a little trust take hold. Every cell of my being dislikes you. How can I trust you? Do I gotta remind you how this came about? Let's not get wound up. You're not yourself. That's it. I had enough Johnny today. Got shit to take care of. See you pop back in your box, genie. Fuck you, V.